Hello, my name is April Corta. I'm with SDISD. I am the Assistant Director to the Business Diversity Program. I manage the SWIMB program. So I'm here to tell you how to do business with SDISD. The most important thing that I can tell you is how to register with us on Bonfire. Um, when you register with us, that is the most important thing. That is how we know um, you and your business. Um, it's easy to do. It's your username. Password, um, the most important thing is going to be your commodity codes. You want to list every goods and service commodity code that your business provides. Also, um, within the commodity codes, there are um, codes within codes. So make sure you list every code that your goods and services provide because you are going to miss out on other solicitations that we do um, sent out. Um, that's the most important thing. Another thing is if you are a certified vendor as a SWIMBY, which is small minority women owned, veteran owned, you want to upload your certification. If you are in a process of getting your SWIMBY certification, you can upload um, anytime or um, you can update your Bonfire account anytime as well. So if you have any questions, you will contact me um, or if you forget your um, passcode or username, you can also contact me on that as well. Um, there's also other certifications um, agencies that we do accept SWIMBY certifications from. There's five of them actually. Um, the National Minority Supplier Development Council, the, the US um, Small Business um, Administration, Women's Business Enterprises, National Women Business Owners Corporation, and other organizations that our superintendent also approves as well. The main one um, that we do accept is the South Central Texas Regional Certification Agency, which is the SCTRCA. We are on the board. Um, SCISD has been on the board for 15 years now. Um, so if you have any questions on how to get certified, if you're not certified, you can also contact me on that as well and I'll be able to assist you. The next thing I want to talk about that's more uh, that's important as well to register with us is our vendor packet. So our vendor packet is a link that we have on our website as well. And um, it's a three pager. It's um, information about your business, a uh, conflict of interest form, and also your W9 form. Now, when you get processed with this, you're going to get a vendor number from SAISD. This does not mean that you are a vendor with SAIC once, you're, you're, once you get a vendor number and your packet has been processed. What this means is you just have a vendor number. When you become a vendor with SAISD, that means you got awarded a contract with us. So you don't become a vendor with SAISD unless you get an awarded a contract. So I wanna make sure that that is clear to everyone um, today is once you are awarded a contract with SAISD, that's when you become a vendor with us. Um, you can also email me and I can send you that packet as well. And all you do is fill it out, send it back to me and I can get that process for you. It's a really easy thing for you to do. It's a three pager. Um, keep in mind, we are a decentralized district and it would be up to the departments um, if they want to utilize your company as well. So that's another important thing that um, everybody needs to know. We are decentralized district. So you can email us, um, email any department, any campus that you want to do business with. Um, if you go onto our website, we have all our campuses listed and all our departments listed and each staff member has their email address. We do want to um, emphasize we don't like um, visits on campuses because of we don't like distractions for schools and students. So that's another thing you can email um, any of our staff if you would like to meet with somebody and to let and meet with them about your goods and services for your business. Um, our website has a lot of good information, our procurement services website. You want to go on there because um, you learn about doing business with us, which is our bonfire portal. That's where you're going to register with us. Um, it has our current and past solicitations. Um, also our approved co-ops, um, co which is our cooperatives and our agreement, um, interlocal agreements as well and our bid opening schedules. So that's where um, you'll see our past um, bid openings that all our board has approved. And also you're going to see the um, bid opportunities that are coming up as well. So you wanna take a look at our procurement service webpage as you know, every day, daily or weekly if you can. Um, another thing what we look for is when you are applying for a contract is experience, experience demand and delivery. So, 
experience, we love to have vendors that have experience with school districts. Now, some, some of you are saying, well, we don't have experience in school districts. The best thing to do is have another um, contractor, another vendor that has a contract with us and doing business with us and do work for them as a third party vendor or as a third party contractor, subcontractor. Because when you do see a bid out and you do apply, then you can say, I do have school work experience, um, school district experience because I did this work for so-and-so. And you could get a recommendation from that previous contractor or vendor or supplier that you have worked for. And that will give you that experience that we need from um, for our application or contract. Um, demand, we, we, the, what we say in demand is sometimes we do need a campus needs, let's just say, hypothetically 500 chairs in two days. Can you meet that demand um, delivery? Can you meet that delivery in two days? So um, we look at all those things. It just depends on solicitation or the bid that is going out for that campus or department. Um, financial stability, we look at that. Staff, um, like I said, if you're a swimming vendor, um, delivery and demand. And also if you accept school district POs, that's very important to us. Um, so if you do accept those things, we also look for that as well. Um, notice of award. Um, when you receive our award letter and you, you get a contract from us, that's when we ask for documentation. We don't ask for documentation up front when you're registering on our bonfire. That's why it's so easy for you to register with SAISD. All you're doing is creating a profile. So we do need documentation from you. It will come with your award letter. Okay, so um, SAISD uses um, the following purchasing co-ops, um, Buy Board, Choice Partners, Northeast ISD, also Region 20. Those are the main co-ops that we do use. But if you go to our website, we have 15 other co-ops listed. So you wanna take a look because those are other bid opportunities that you can use and utilize for your business and grow your business as well. Okay, the other thing I wanna talk about is our bond 2020 that just passed on November 3rd. I wanna thank all our community here at SAISD and all our voters. Thank you, thank you for voting for our bond 2020. For this um, vote, we are having $1.3 billion that's gonna benefit all our schools and all our students. So we are very, very happy. Um, with this money, we are going to utilize $90 million in technology upgrades. Also 36 of our campuses are going to get renovated and we're going to get all new chillers. So if you are in the construction industry, um, HVAC, architect firms, engineering firms, um, construction, furniture, all these bid solicitations for bond 2020 are going to be through our bonfire system. That's why it's so important for you to register through Bonfire if you are not registered already with us. So all the solicitations are coming out through there. Currently right now we do have an RFQ out for um, engineering um, firms and architect firms and also business consulting. So please take a look at that. It does close on December 2nd at 2 p.m. So if you're interested, please take a look at that. And the next um, RFQ is gonna come out in February and that's going to be for um, general contractors. So we are moving very fast and we do wanna get all our um, schools upgraded and everything that needs to be completed. So be on the lookout, register with us and thank you for voting for, you know, voting for our bond 2020.